All right, guys, so today I am showing my front carbon lip from ECS Tuning for this puppy. Now, I don't know what's going on with ECS ever since COVID. Um, the shipping has been going insanely slow. So this took me about three months to get. And I'm also waiting on coilovers. But we'll talk about that later. So here she is in all of her carbon glory. I'm gonna lay it out on the table here. Came in a little early to the shop today to do this. Somebody else is in. It's literally like six in the morning right now. <laughs> so bear with me. But yeah. It's pretty freaking beautiful. It's definitely wrapped up nicely. They just have to work on their shipping because that took way too long. And I'm literally about to cancel my damn order for these coilovers and just get them from somewhere else. Because four months is ridiculous. So let's see. Quality is really nice. The weave is nice. So of course I was pissed off. And she uh, immediately said, what about those carbon thingies? Can we get one of those carbon front lips for it? Wouldn't that cover it up? So I searched all around, trying to find one that would actually cover up the damage. And of course, This was the closest one I could find, but this damn one doesn't even cover up all the damage and scratch marks. Of course. So it actually sits pretty nicely flush on there. Goes up. This is all clear broad, so it's not going to scratch anything. But here's the damage. Okay. 
Thanks, honey. <laughs> I can't give her too much crap. Because she's so instrumental in my life. It's not even funny. So, it has like this little space here. If it, if it came flush all the way up and came across, it would have covered all this. A buddy of mine here at the shop, Nelson, was saying, shout out to Nelson, um, Drift King. Uh, he was saying, yo, just wrap this part black. So I'll give it a little bit more intensity, mean look. Oh, it's a nice scratch on the carbon. Thanks, ECS. That's like in there too. It's pretty nice. It comes with um, double-sided tape. And then pretty much, I would just need to do self-tappers there and everywhere else here for the other 10 holes. Um, and then I have the slip low that I just put on a customer's Porsche 911. I'm gonna put that on here as well. So. What do you guys think? Is it aggressive enough? Does it help? Because I just think the body of this car is way too subtle. Um, it's the only thing. Just have to make it much more aggressive. The performance is there. The performance is amazing. But this shit just needs way more aggression. So, I'm gonna get this lip installed. And we're gonna do some side carbon fiber. Has a look from the side. Oh, it pokes out nice on the side. I got a nice uh, couple of other things coming for it too, so stay tuned for that shit. Yeah, this is it's pretty rough. I think the, um, the clear bra though makes it look a little bit worse than it really is too. You never know, who knows? Alright, so that's one bolt and one side. my twin bush lift by the way shout out to them really good quality lifts scissor lifts which is perfect for vinyl wrappers All right, so the install went pretty well. Um, some of the spots on it weren't as tight as I think I would like them to have been. Um, but I do believe that that's the the clearance. I think that is how it's supposed to be. Um, let's bring it down and take a look. All right, my guys, so I almost forgot. Before I bring her down, I wanted to wrap this portion of red here just to see if it looks nice, makes any difference. So we're gonna give it a shot. So 
carbon lip. Here's the part that I just that I just wrapped in black. But the only thing is that this still shows some red down here where the lip connects. So, I mean, it doesn't look bad. But it does still show some red anyway. I'm gonna do a little bit more. And I'll be right back. I think it looks pretty sick. some comments give me some comments guys all right I'm going to add the it's like a grill protection I'm sorry uh, carbon lip protection have it here in my box I'll show you this one here bring it back up in the air the underside and then these puppies go on there either way you can do it like this or you can put them this way um, but I'm definitely gonna need it because this thing scrapes just going into my driveway now at this stock height so oof definitely looks meaner sheesh Oh yeah, I usually don't ride stock, but um, in this case, a lot of the parts have taken so damn long, didn't get anything yet, so. Oof, that's mean. Hi, my guys, I'm going to lift it back up and add the slip low underneath and um, give you a little more footage of that. But for the most part, this video is a wrap. Whew, it's my little baby. I went to a Cars and Coffee yesterday and it was mostly Porsches and BMWs. Um, so it kind of hurt me to to pull up stock. I mean, granted, this is just as fast or faster than some of those cars there, but it just looks so sleeper, which is good in a lot of ways, but for me, I'm used to like the, the flares and the crazy like from the Evo days, so. But this is a monster and it definitely has much more aggression now. Um, but anyway, thanks for watching. Um, make sure you share this video like it give me some comments do you think that the lip is kind of eh you think it's nice do you like the weave you think i should have bought an m2 comp <laughs> all right make sure you follow print coat rapid on instagram and um i'll check you guys next time peace